One thing uh, I want to mention here is that, you know, I don't know what type of visa your mom got to move to the United States of America, but her visa has to be uh, valid, okay? Uh, if she overstayed a visa, that can be a problem, but... USA Mon. Hello, my beautiful people. Welcome back. If it's your first time here, welcome. In this video, I'm going to go over two questions I received from uh, some of you guys regarding R130 process without further ado let's start uh, the first question is coming from uh, osaren rain humphrey uh, qc9800 here is the question good morning john uh, thanks for your update please uh, i misplaced my original marriage certificate can usa embassy accept a certified through copy hope to get my interview later soon well thanks for the question i hope you get your interview later soon as well so um well uh if you check nvc website uh, they uh, always mention that if you go to the interview you have to take either the original of uh, the civil document you submit your nvc or a certified copy okay so meaning that they will uh, accept the certified copy so if you don't have uh, the original of your uh, uh, marriage certificate the original one if you don't have it yes you can take the certified copy of the marriage certificate to the interview okay so that's what i have for you uh, regarding uh, this uh, question where well, we're going to jump on the second question this one is coming from uh jordana 32 23 here is the question we got a document to qualify yesterday. My mom is the principal applicant and she's living in USA already. She's been uh, there since 2016. I'm in Togo. They say the location of the interview is Paris. She was born in France but never lived there. As uh, she's already in the USA, is there any way for her to do the interview there? Well, thanks for the question. That's a very good question. But before I answer this question, if you discover me for the first time, my name is John. My main goal here is to help newcomers, permanent residents, and also U.S. citizens regarding the I-130 petition process. Uh, you know, sometimes we cover other topics so that can help newcomers to have a better life here in the United States of America. So, to answer your question, that's a good question, like I say, right? Uh, well, if... Uh, you are a principal applicant, like the beneficiary, the intended immigrant, right? Uh, and uh, you're supposed to get an immigrant visa to come to the United States of America. And, uh, you know, maybe you get a non-immigrant visa, you, uh, you know, move to the United States of America, and you want to continue the process in the U.S., well, you will contact NVC. Well, the petitioner can contact NVC and let NVC know that, okay, the beneficiary now uh, is uh, living uh, in the U.S. now. Therefore, NVC will send uh, the case back to USCIS because if the beneficiary lives in the U.S., then USCIS is supposed to take care of that case. It's no longer NVC that will take care of that case, that will uh, uh, process that case, okay? And then um, once NVC send that case uh, to USCIS, USCIS will process, will contact the beneficiary, you know, set up a uh, appointment, a fingerprint appointment, any of your appointment, all those stuff, okay? Uh, and then you mentioned also that they said the location of the uh, the interview is in Paris. Well, if your mom won't go to Paris or to the interview, well, if uh, she doesn't want to go to Togo either, then she can uh, request, uh, uh, like I said, uh, the petitioner in this case can request, uh, uh, can send a request to NVC and let them know that, okay, uh, your mom uh, will uh, continue the process here in the United States of America. But uh, one thing uh, I want to mention here is that, you know, I don't know what type of visa your mom got to move to the United States of America, but her visa has to be uh, valid, okay? Uh, if she overstayed a visa, that can be a problem, but I don't provide any legal advice here. Uh, if there is an issue, it's better for your mom to contact an immigration uh, attorney or lawyer to assist her so guys that's all i have for you today if you like the video like always click on the like button share the video and don't forget to subscribe once again my name is john thanks for watching and i'll talk to you in another video usa monday